chain is to the center of his body. He's basically doing a push up first and then pulling through. All right, so what we're working here is actually you got your everything stabilized here. So when you're pulling, you got the string lap, tricep work, chest and shoulders, obviously, with the push up. So, what we typically do here, we run, we run about probably eight, nine, and 12 stations. And we do each exercise for three minutes because Binky's a professional fighter and their, their rounds are typically three to five minutes. And we simulate the, the amount of time that they do in these rings to, to the work that's being um, displayed here. So this is lightweight, so Binky might get up talking about he's hurt, but he's all right. <laughs> Do some rope pulls right here. You know, trying to keep everything stabilized here. Hips, hips and quads, back. All right, so what we do, we usually we're stacked up here. And then we do some, some back pedaling here. Try to work on some good footwork. Ah, he's the shortest. Good job. Good job. So for a lot of, you know, high school, middle school kids, college kids as well, not you, George, you ain't ready yet. <laughs> so we do this all, all for speed. It's, it's, a, it's a pull exercise, just like Vicky was doing. And we try to do pull, push, different days as well. All right, good stuff, thanks, sir. Sledgehammers, and this is working your whole body. So he's gonna show you just the regular, regular bang. So what we typically do is try like 10 to 15 on each side. Then we rest for 20 seconds, and then we do it again. Where's Tony at? Hey, Tony, I got the 100 pounds for you and uh, Derek in the back. <laughs> <laughs> and then you can display this one. Too. So this demonstration right here is just a straight isolation uh, for your lats. So those of y'all that don't know where your lats are, all these muscles right here. ISO, ISO and M, 100%. So again, we do about 20 to 25 of these. All right? All right, good stuff. What's so, up, Rocky Music? <laughs> fight coming up next Friday night at the Burns in Baltimore. She'll be 7 0 after we uh, leave out of there Friday night. So, are we coming in? You know, I've been working with Amelia for about probably four months now. You know, she's like my little sister, and she looks up to me, which is fantastic, because I help her out with a lot of things, and we just keep networking and make sure that she's in shape. Even though her boxing coach doesn't believe in this type of workout, she's a, she tells him, I'm not doing anything else. So when she tells her boxing stroke coach, excuse me, that she's got a strength and conditioning coach, they're like, oh shit, but sorry kids. But at the same time, <laughs> but at the same time, she's putting in work, and I know that anybody that she fights, along with all these other fighters, and they're in better shape from a strength and conditioning standpoint, hands down. It makes a difference, trust me. My jab, as far, like, my jab, my crosses, way stronger. I mean, I had a jab, my last fight, I was from cutting a lot of weight, it was a little weak, but my jab alone was strong enough for a knockout. I mean, that's how far it's come, just from working out with him. I, mean, I can't speak highly enough of it, it was, it's amazing. So Matt here, he's another one of my professional guys. He's doing some bent over rows now with the sandbags. About 60 pounds of sand in there. Megan's doing sandbag flip with squats. So you're working your shoulders, your biceps, and your quads as well. Wayne right here is doing some ball throws and squats. Jill right here, she's doing some kettlebell swings. A lot of people are familiar with that because kettlebells are pretty hot and heavy right now. Wayne right here is doing some push-ups. Push-ups on the ball, working on that balance. Extreme chest exercise for sure, and anybody can do them. So I have women that do these as well, on their knees, weighing short set on your, on your knees. You can modify it. Yep, so for all the women that say you can't do a push-up, we start here, but then we'll get to the top. So you right? That's right. So just keep flowing out. Just keep Yeah, Wayne. Oh, you changed up. So Wayne's doing some kettlebell swings 
right here. Everybody that's like getting banged up in the ribs, and the abs, that's strong core work and lower back right there. Alright? Just blow one more time. I'm gonna have wings. Knees to the backs of the arms, look forward. 